right, time to present a new game here. This one's very interesting. It's called Murder is Game Over. It's a point and click adventure about the death of a famous game developer. The company behind this game, Meridian 4, they hooked me up with a free version of the title. So I'm gonna present to you like 20 or 30 minutes of the title to get a first impression. If I like it, I may do a full let's play on that, but I'll determine that later. Let's just get into this mysterious case and start a new game. So I love love me a good point and click adventure game. Press enter or space bar to advance the game text. You can also use the mouse cursor to point and click. It's a point and click, so of course I want a point and click. That's the, that's the point of point and click. That's the point and click of point and click adventures. Introduction. Also a very old school look, which is Right up my alley, so rural vermin, present day. Billy Kramer, Arian Jones. Hope the music is loud enough. Russell, I'm telling you, it fell off the castle roof and almost hit me. Ari, that's ridiculous. There's never been an anvil on the roof. I have work to do. I know this time has been hard for you. I promise we'll go to the art supply store as soon as I finish those these negotiations, all right? I'm sorry, gentlemen. Things have been crazy recently for Melissa and I. I understand. It was huge of you to take Ari in when she had nowhere else to go. Yes, yes, enough with the distractions. Russell, have you signed the contract yet? Not yet, Mr. Kramer. I still need time to read it. I've embarked down running extra security features. Um, Lord Gallant, your highness. I'd appreciate being able to talk with you about my concerns privately first. That's why I drove up from New York. Frankly, I don't see why we couldn't do this at the Hack Division publishing office in the city. But Russell insisted. Jim Wickman, excuse me, Mr. Gallant, you've got a visitor outside, sir. Fans again? No, it's not the gamer club from the community college looking for autographs this time. Holy mackerel, what's that? You should leave this place. You're treating on hollowed ground. Leah, I know you're frustrated, but Castle Ludwig is private property now. You can't just show up and harass the new owners. What the hell is going on here? Honey, what's going on out here? Russell, she followed us from the park. So you must be the Lord Gallant. Listen, why don't you and your wife go back to Manhattan while you still can? Leave now, or I'll call the police. You're trespassing. You're the one who's trespassing. You don't belong here. Don't you feel the presence all around? You've angered the spirits of Castle Ludwig. You've angered the gargoyle. The gargoyle? She means that stone statue? This is your last warning, Russell Gallant. Beware the curse of Castle Ludwig. Gargoyle's Curse. The Investigation. The following evening. From a I love me some retro look. Well, hello there. You, you must be Cleo, the remarkable clue-sniffing dog we've heard so much about. Aww. Excuse me. Hello and welcome, Detective Guy. So glad you made it. This one's truly a baffling case and we need your help. I'll fill you in on the basics. What do you want to know first? Don't worry, I'm here to help you get your bearings. I don't like it when the game characters tell you how to operate in the game, how to control the game. But okay, let's not be too hard. Use the arrow keys to move. Holding down the shift key will make you move faster. So it's kind of hybrid point and click and adventure style, I guess. To talk to someone, press enter or space bar. Space bar or enter will select a dialogue option. I like the music. Press escape to access the menu 
and see the case file, then press escape again to close the menu. If you need a hint about what to do next, you can access the hint function via the menu. An illustrated map of the castle and surrounding area can be found in the menu too. Lastly, you can use the menu to save your game. Please details. Well, very well, let's get right to it. Who am I? <laughs> That's a good question. You're a man in need of no introduction around here. Can, is he not surprised that I asked that kind of question? You've already helped solve some tough ones. But even more famous is Cleo, your partner in crime solving. She's a glue-sniffing dog. Cleo can find clues, we humans can't. You and Cleo make quite the team. Press S to toggle between Guy or Cleo as the leader. Where are we? I like that they show me what question I already asked in case I forget. Castle Ludwig here in rural Vermont was a tourist attraction before the victim bought the place. It's a real castle. I'm no expert, but there have been rumors about the castle. Evil spirits, strange stuff. Have fun with that. Who's the victim? The victim is Lord Russell Gallen, the owner of Castle Ludwig. It was big news when he bought this place. Heard of him? Even people who don't play video games know about Paladin Dream. Russell Gallant designed the game. Lord Gallant's successful game made him a very wealthy man. Well, now he's dead. How did he die? The coroner is by the entrance to Castle Ludwig. She can tell you more about the cause of death based on her expertise. Persons of interest. It seems the victim had some kind of business meeting here last night. A publishing executive and a co-worker came to negotiate. Also inside the castle are the, the victim's wife and adopted daughter, plus the groundskeeper. You should interview them all. A small number of other people were nearby too. You'll meet them via the mountain road. There are eight suspects. I'm ready. We're counting on you, detective guy, and you too, Cleo. Good luck. <laughs> okay, I also like a good crime story, so... Let's see what hmm. we can do. Uh, I can't control with the WASD as they suggested. So now I'm in full point and click mode. Anyway, then let's just use point and click. Two suspects. Auto save or why has this all been saved? Or did I press the wrong button? This is because I got a version of the game, but then. Okay, then let's just do point and click style. Fireman, cute dog, but I'm not in the mood to play. This is a crime scene after all. Press S to toggle between Guy or Cleo as the leader. Hmm. Okay, I can do that. My team has secured the area for you to do your job. No one comes in, no one goes out. This way, everything is left untouched. You should look for clues. Once you find something important, I'll move out so you can explore the mountain road. Corona. Good evening, detective. I'm the Corona. How can I help you with your investigation? Where's the body? You'll find the victim's body along the castle wall to the west. Everything is left untouched. Once you've assess assessed the body, you'll be free to explore the castle. Cause of death? That gargoyle fell off the roof and struck his head. Mm, suspicious. I've never seen anything like it. The touch of the dramatic, for sure. The force of the blow must have killed him instantly. No doubt about that, but take a look for yourself. The time of death, Mr. Gallant died between 7 and 8 p.m. last night. Didn't we already see kind of... Who did it and what happened but we I guess need the details and maybe it's not as obvious as it seems so between 7 and 8 p.m. last night that's just about 24 hours ago your theory that gargoyle is quite heavy it would take more than a gust of wind to make it fall over I don't have an explanation nothing more get serious detective I'm not talking to a dog Hmm, it's worth a try. Officer Bailey? Us local police have been all over Russell Gallant's estate already, but we haven't found any clues. However, your clue-sniffing dog might be able to find something we missed. You should explore with Cleo as party leader. 
So let's do some sniffing. Oh, there's the body. Rest in peace. <laughs> the dead body of the famous eccentric video game designer, Lord Russell Gallant. It obviously happened just as the corona said. But to be crushed by a gargoyle outside a supposedly haunted castle, that seems at least a little bit suspicious. Did you learn how Russell Gallon was killed? Fallen gargoyle. Brilliant deduction. Enter the castle, yes. When you've got enough evidence that you think you're ready to make an arrest, come back here and find me. Good luck. So this is where the victim lived. In this castle, when I speak with Gallant household members, I should remember. Not everyone is necessarily telling the truth. If I ever find a relevant piece of evidence, then it might jog somebody's memory. That way they'll cooperate. If you unlocked a new area, check the map menu for an updated map. Will the game give me hints? I haven't met all the suspects yet. So far I've identified zero suspects out of eight total. Okay, I don't want any more hints. I may need it at one point. Front of the castle main hall, organ room. What's an organ room? Office, north hall, garden, kitchen, dining room, upper hall, arcade, master bedroom, bedroom, path to a big place for sure. So, doggo, find something. Hmm. You're right, Cleo. I should let you sniff for clues so I don't miss anything. Press S to toggle, blah blah blah. So. Find some oh, Cleo found a clue. I can only see it when Cleo finds a cigarette butt. Who would leave this on the table? How does the dog know that this is a clue? The clue is saved to your case file. Cleo deserves a treat. Have one. Good girl. Oh boy. I don't know. So. Um. Kind of point and click adventure. There are finger marks on the dusty organ. Maybe it was played recently. Nice song, Cleo. I don't detect anything else unusual about the organ. That's what they mean with organ. Hello, Mr. Wickman. Hey, keep the dark away. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hmm. Can I help you? Suspect added to case file. Jim Wickman, castle groundskeeper. Suspect found, one of eight. This guy reeks of cigarettes. Now I know who dropped the cigarette, but yeah, but is it unusual that smokers drop cigarettes? Does that make him <laughs> suspicious? What does the cigarette have to do with it? Uh, the dark thinks the cigarette is a clue. Who are you? My name is James Jim Wickman. Russell kept me on to renovate the castle. I look after the grounds, worked here for years. Castle info. Let's, let's just go through the list. I've been the groundskeeper here long since it was a tourist attraction owned by the town, before they sold it out to Gallant. Russell Gallant lived in this wing with his wife and uh, his daughter. The north area is the sealed wing. That area is badly in need of repair. I've locked it for safety reasons. Russell had planned to have me renovate it. As a groundskeeper, I have the key. Should you have a need to go up there, let me know. Nobody's been there. Seen anything strange? Me personally? Nah. People say they see or hear all kinds of stuff at Castle Ludwig. I just do my job. But his wife has been acting strangely since they arrived. She can tell you about what she saw. She's in the dining room. The publisher man who showed up yesterday was rude to me. He's holed up in the study. Are they all still here? Oh yeah, and one more thing. Stay out of the forest. It's dangerous. Your alibi. Where was I when he died? I was here pretty much. I was polishing the suits of armor 
and minding my own business. Your theory just seems like a freak accident to me. I mean, it's sad that he died. You always treated me real good. Nothing else. Now. that much to the gameplay that we have to switch in between, but anyway. It adds to the flair of the game, which is also important. I don't understand, Cleo. Hey, why is this here? I should see whether any... Uh, otherwise, I guess the storyline would make sense. I should see whether anybody in the castle knows about this bizarre anvil. Why is this in the garden? That's a good point. Sniffing dogs? How does the dog really understand what's happening here? How does the dog know? The animal is so suspicious. Oh, yeah, it is. This is so obvious. Even the dog can see it. Not, no trespassing in the woods. Storm. This must be the door to the sealed wing of the castle and the grand keeper, Mr. Woodman, is locked, but we got a key. Hmm. How can we use that? Can he give us a key? Hmm. Case file. Can we open this door? Anyway, then let's go somewhere else first. Billy Kramer. Hmm. Hello, Billy. Make it quick, detective. The sooner I can get out of this one cow town, the better. I'm so rude. Suspect added to case by Billy Kramer, executive vice president of Hack Division Games. Suspects found, two of nine. Who are you? The name's Billy Kramer the second. My father founded Hack Division Games and published Paladin Dream. I came here from New York for a business meeting with Russell Gallant last night. Castle info. The castle? This place isn't too shabby, but I prefer my Park Avenue penthouse. Seen anything strange? I was here in Russell's office yesterday. We were going over the contract for the new game when his wife interrupted us. It happened just before he died. Mr. Gallant, if you'll just sign the stand-up contract, then everything will be in order for the new game. Russell, the goggle on the roof moved again. Outside, come quick! I'm terribly sorry about this, Mr. Kramer. Uh, I'll just be in a moment. I didn't know what to make of it. At the time, Russell seemed embarrassed, but not so su surprised by his wife's outburst. She screamed, something over a gargoyle, uh, something about a gargoyle, and Russell followed her outside. I waited for a long time. Then the police arrived. The meeting was adjourned permanently. Your alibi. I was in this room the whole time, alone. I didn't even know he had been shot. I mean, he died. Oh, that's suspicious that he uses different verbiage. Well, I certainly didn't have anything to do with it. That groundskeeper wandering around seems a little sketchy to me. You all seem sketchy to me, but I suppose a creepy castle has to have a sketchy groundskeeper. It's like a law. Done for now. Does the game show me all the things we can interact with? Kitchen. There's something. Cleo found a doggy bag. No, Cleo, we don't have time to eat now. I've got miss she deserves some food. Alright, we'll take the doggy back with us after we solve the case. I promise you'll get an amazing treat. She deserves a treat. I bet there are at least 30 doggy bags like this hidden all over the area. Let's see how many we can. What's in a doggy bag? I'm not too familiar with that. <laughs> so, another dog owner. 
There's another doggy bag. Clear found a doggy bag. Total doggy bags found two of thirty. Good for her. There's the wife. Hmm. Let's talk to the wife and be extra careful here. Detective guy. Is it? What can I do to help? Suspect added to case found. Melissa Devon Gallant, widow of the deceased. Suspects found. Who are you? I'm Melissa Devon Gallant and Russell was my husband. I can't believe he's gone. I told him not to buy the castle. Russell and I met at a sci-fi convention in New York. I was a fan of his work. I wrote to him. We fell in love that weekend. Russell was a boy at heart game. At heart. Games, castles, cosplay. When he asked me to be his lady gallant, I was starstruck. Still in love, love the little emoticons over their heads. Russell and I moved into Castle Ludwig just after the wedding two months ago. Oh, not too long ago. Soon after, it's I started seeing things. The gargoyles stared me down. The suits of armor moved just a little. It was as evil spirit. It was as the evil spirits in the legend told. Then after he adopted that orphan girl, it got worse. The pipe organ suddenly started playing. Oh my god, that freaks me out just hearing about it. Russell didn't believe any of it. Couldn't you hear that? To be honest, I'm not sure what's real anymore, but I believe the story's based on what happened. I've seen anything so strange. Everything was strange, I guess. Strange everything about Ka Everything about Castle Ludwig is strange. I was there when he died and I saw the whole thing with my own eyes. I was out for my usual walk last evening while Russell was meeting with those two business associates. As I walked along the edge of the castle, that gargoyle started laughing at me. I went in and called for Russell. Then I showed him the spot where it happened. As he looked up, the gargoyle fell on him. The curse on Castle Ludwig has come true. It's horrible. Your alibi. Are you implying that you don't believe me? The gargoyle fell off the roof and killed my husband as I looked on. If you stood next to the... I just watched my poor husband get crushed to death by that laughing demon face. A short while later, the police arrived. Okay, I guess we have evidence that he really got crushed. Ethan must have called them. I was beside myself. Surely you understand? I was scheduled to meet Ethan at the town park for a workout. You should be able to find him there. So there, detective guys. Guy, that's where I was when it all happened. At my husband's side. Your theory. If you're looking for somebody to point the finger at, I'd start with Gary Small, the game tester. Russell was working on some sort of big deal with Hack Division Publishing for a new Paladin Dream game. I heard Russell arguing heatedly with Gary Small last night, the man who stayed over in the arcade upstairs. But I wouldn't be surprised if that angry girl, Leah Ludwig, is responsible for the curse. She harassed us. You'll find Leah and her followers in the cemetery east of the castle from the mountain ridge. She lives on the cemetery? My condolences. windows from which people inside the castle can see outside. However, the wall by where the victim was killed has no win had no windows. That's unusual. The clue is safe to your case file. Cleo deserves a treat. Yeah, give her one. You found a doggy bag. Aspects of the game. Find these bags. There's something. Cleo found a clue. It looks like an old library book. Somebody left here. The book title is Historic Castle Ludwig. Castle Ludwig was built in 1900 by wealthy, not that old castle, a wealthy quarry owner, Herr Wilhelm Ludwig. Is he German? Is this game taking place in Germany? Though he died shortly after finishing construction of the castle, I read that this game is also available in German, but I 
only got the English version. So, a myriad of strange events have led many people to believe that Castle Ludwig is haunted. This book explores the castle's incredible history. Clue saved her case file, Clue deserves a treat. Does she actually get the treats or does she just deserve them? Or does she just deserve them? Um, hmm. So, where to go? Do they tell me something new now? Where's the body? I think we already talked about that. Second floor hall. Hmm. Very small, there's an arcade. Paladin Dream Arcade Game. Play the game. Can the dog play? Russell Gallon wanted to bring turn paced RPGs to arcades. He was a mad genius. <laughs> this is the final battle in Paladin Dream, but something seems a bit different from my memory. Oh, this is cute. Oh, I saw a powerful bite attack from a tough dog or bark. Zara the Nightmare. Stop and think about the case not useful in your slap. A weak slap attack from a wimpy detective. Why are we not characters in the game? Cleo's barking scares the enemy. Think. Hmm. I haven't met all the suspects yet, so far I've identified 3 suspects. Out of 8 total, I should probably be concentrating on the boss battle, instead of thinking about the game. Maybe other way around. <laughs> maybe we find something in there. Maybe the developer left a clue in the game. This different kind of version of the game. We actually won! Clear and guy, beat the game! Credits. Created by Lord Gallant. Programming by Russell Gallant. Art by Mike and Sarah Jones. Old Nintendo game. Uh, game testing by Gary Small. Paladin Dream published by Hack Division Games. Can we play these other games? Hmm. There's another dummy back. Hmm. Need to talk to Mr. Small. I just can't believe he's gone. Suspect ad case by Gary Small. Game tester with Hack Division Games. Who are you? I'm Gary Small. I worked in Paladin Dream with the deceased for many years as the lead tester. I came up from New York yesterday to try and talk some sense into Russell. I hoped I could get him to finally recognize my contribution on the game, but he doesn't listen. That sounds suspicious. Castle info. This castle is amazing. Gosh, Russell had it good. Millions of dollars. Millions of fans. A beautiful trophy wife. Trophy wife? Tell me he did not just say that. I guess Lord Gallant had it a little too good. Why do you talk in a suspicious way to a police officer? Seen anything strange? Oh. I heard a gunshot. Assuming I wasn't imagining things. Second person mentioning a gun? After my argument was with Ruth Russell yesterday, I came up here. He had a bed laid out for me and I slept. Boom. And then I was woken up by what sounded like the shot downstairs. Your alibi. I was in this room asleep. I know it's weak. The bed is in the middle of the room. Your theory. I'm sure Billy Kramer wanted him dead. Hack Division was losing a fortune paying Russell royalties on Paladin Dream. I never saw another dime after the game released myself. Didn't this witch just... Uh, make the Gargon fall down or... Who saw that? I forgot. Is that a Godzilla poster? So I never saw another dime after the game released myself. I wouldn't be surprised if Billy th brought his gun to help negotiate with Russell. It doesn't explain the fallen gargoyle outside though. I don't know. My specialty is video game logic. The real world is your department. Thank you. Cat. Hmm. I think the cat likes me. It's so dark in here. Hmm. Ariane Jones, she's playing Xbox. So what? So what is this? 
Cleo found a clue. Living trust. It's Iron John's trust. This is interesting. It says, if Russell Gallant dies, Ariane inherits her parents' fortune before she turns 18. The clue is saved to your case, case file. Leo deserves a treat. And I'm gonna save. <sighs> this is Murder is Game Over. Very interesting game. I may continue playing because I want to know how this case get solved, who the murderer really was, and yeah, I'll probably see you soon. On LTV, check out this game if you like what you've seen, and I'll see you soon. Bye bye.